Superintendent Dr. Brian Johnson gave his State of the System address to discuss the progress of Hamilton County Schools in the past year. Channel 3's Brian Didlake has the highlights. Brian, tell us what we learned tonight. Well, Greg, Cindy, according to Dr. Johnson, Hamilton County Schools has seen major improvements over the past three to four years. The county's graduation rate in 2018 was 86.5%, and that's the highest it's been since 2012 and 2013. JFK said we choose to go to the moon not because it's easy but because it's hard. In his State of the System speech, Dr. Brian Johnson says Hamilton County Schools are reaching for the stars. According to Dr. Johnson, the school district met state standards for the first time in three years. He also mentioned under his administration, the school system started out with a million dollars less this fiscal year. He says 92% of that is dedicated solely towards schools. You know, we don't want to just tell you all the good. We want to tell you where our challenges are. Because what we realize as a public school system is that we cannot solve the challenges in isolation. Two of five students entering kindergarten are deemed not ready to learn. Dr. Johnson says a more troubling statistic is only one in three third graders are at or above grade level on the state literacy assessment. And that statistic is repeated in the county all the way through high school. Access is a real roadblock. It's a challenge for us and we have to continue to overcome it. And access isn't just about transportation, even though that's a, an element of it. Access is about counselor support for social emotional services. Access is about access to technology. Access to technology that Mark Hetrick and his robotics team at CSAS needs. Just outside, the team showed off their research about what astronauts face in space. Hetrick says learning is what makes him think about the future. Like at a company learning about that stuff and then maybe move on to something and make my own company about that, one of that topic. I hope that you join me in making a promise not just to them but to those that will come after them. Dr. Johnson is set to go on a listening tour. The first day is set for next Monday at Red Bank Middle at 6 p.m. You can find when a session is near you inside the WRCB app. But for now, live in the studio, Brian Ditley, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.